What is up guys and welcome back to the vlog. So right now it is currently 6 p.m. in Wisconsin time, Central time, which means it would be 4 o'clock back home in Las Vegas. I am literally just waking up from the fattest nap of 2016 and I'm like, holy shit. I'm super jet lagged and I have to get vlog footage for you guys. So now I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do for the rest of the day. We're still at Jordan's grandma's house right now. He's been spending time with her today all day on her birthday and I got to catch up on some sleep. So total, I actually ended up getting, I think three, four, like about five hours of sleep, which, mm, not the greatest, but then again, it's not too bad. I just want to thank all of you for watching yesterday's vlog, even though it was short, and understanding that, you know, I had some crazy jet lag, wasn't much to vlog, running around to do, and stuff like that. I vlogged what I could when I was running around. For those of you who don't know, this is Isaiah. He's actually Jordan's friend from Kenya. He's an Olympian runner in Jordan. You know what I just realized? Since I came to Wisconsin and met your family, now you need to come to New York and meet my family. I'm down. When shall we go? Tomorrow? Tomorrow? Next week? Yeah. Beginning of December? I think I'm going there for Christmas. What are your plans around Christmas time? Uh, December 30th or January 11th, I'll be in Kenya. Oh, so we'd have to do it before that. Yeah. Good fun. Well, maybe you'll come to New York. Currently leaving Jordan's grandma's house. I feel like it gets a lot darker in Wisconsin earlier than it does in Las Vegas. I mean, I don't think it gets dark in Vegas until about 7.30, 8 o'clock. Right now it is 6 o'clock here and it's already almost dark out. I actually just got off the phone with Bank of America. I need to take money out of my account and there are no Bank of Americas out here. You said the closest one is what? Like down by Chicago, right? Yeah, close to there. Which is like 80 miles away from where we're gonna be staying, maybe even a little bit more than that. So I just had to call and like increase my ATM withdrawal limit so that way I'm not jumping around from ATM to ATM and you know, racking up all these fees so that way I can get my money out. So right now I think Jordan, Isaiah and I are gonna head over and get some food somewhere. Not too familiar with what they have out here but I'm really not trying to have fast food um, and then I need to maybe go to Walgreens and Walmart another thing that I'm probably gonna end up having to do is T global sucks out here in Wisconsin pretty much everywhere I've gone today I haven't had any service at all so I might have to pay like 35 bucks for a month or whatever and jump on Jordan's line and go get like a Verizon sim card and an unlocked iPhone because a lot of my work that I do is on the internet and it's on my phone so no phone service means no work and no work means no money and I got bills to pay. So we're all a little hungry, haven't had much to eat today, so we're gonna check out this place called Noodles and Company. I guess it's pretty much just like a little pasta shop. Jordan said they have some good food, so let's see how it is. I ended up getting the penne rosa, which is actually pretty good. I also got a small cup of tomato bisque soup. I'm pretty impressed with this place. It was actually really quick, pretty cheap, and it's really good. That food was actually really good, and right now we need to head a few other places. I need to go to Walgreens. I have to get things like a toothbrush. I need some allergy medicine. I need to go to Walmart. I need to get a couple pairs of sweatpants and maybe like a heavier jacket since it's so goddamn cold here in Wisconsin. And then I need to go to the ATM. And what else? Was that it? I think so, yeah. Walgreens, Walmart, and ATM. Oh, and I fucking forgot my vape juice in Vegas. And I just ran out, so I can't even vape right now. So maybe I need to hit an East Sig store tonight. If not tonight, definitely tomorrow. Just made it to Walgreens. Honestly, I feel like the only thing that sucks about traveling is it just messes up everything with a vlog. My sleep schedule is completely screwed right now. As I said, you guys know I only slept two hours last night, and then I took a three-hour nap today, so only five hours of sleep. And I'm completely exhausted right now. I'm honestly ready for bed. But I have a few things to do, and I also need to get some vlog footage for you guys. I think I honestly probably have like $80 worth of shit that I just got from Walgreens. $81.97 worth of stuff at Walgreens. So I stopped into some little hole in the wall e-cig shop and got some wicked watermelon sour e-cig juice. Uh, test this out, see if it's good. Just got to Jordan's house. We're actually going to be dropping Isaiah off because right now it's 4 a.m. Kenyan time. So he's extremely exhausted. We still have to go to Walmart and then we have to go to the bank really fast. So Isaiah needs to get his sleep. We're going to drop him off and then head to those places. I well, I don't know what the hell that was, but I also forgot that we have to drop off the rental car. So Jordan actually needs me to follow him to the rental car place in his mom's car. We're gonna drop this off, then head to Walmart and head to the bank. Hey, 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 I'm beyond all that fuck shit. Hey, 
mama She like to be my sunshine We turn my game up Turn this to Forgot to tell you guys, yesterday everything got straightened out with my license finally. I wish it could have just happened two days sooner so that way I didn't get those tickets. But it just feels good that everything is finally good with my driver's license. But Jordan's mom's other car is a Lincoln and honestly right now I'm loving these heated seats in this cold ass weather. Right now it's saying that it's 48 degrees but my phone says that it's like 38. So it's extremely cold and these heated seats are definitely coming in handy. I'm just hoping that I don't shit myself or else that's gonna be a real messy situation. We just got done at the ATM and just made it to Walmart. Have to get a few things here, some sweatpants and some food. Got everything that we needed at Walmart. Believe it or not, like just buying a few pairs of pants and sweatshirts at Walmart really adds up in price. Jordan also got Isaiah some food. Isaiah likes bread with peanut butter in the morning. He likes Special K strawberry cereal, strawberry yogurt. Jordan got like nine packs of strawberry oatmeal for himself. Badass. So when we first got into Walmart, Jordan went in there to take a shit. And then I walked in to fucking use the bathroom and Jordan shit in the toilet paper was still in the fucking toilet. And I wanted to snap you a picture and call you a scumbag, but my phone's dead. So I couldn't. It's automatic flush. I didn't have to flush. <laughs> well, let me tell you, it didn't automatically flush nothing. Which one are we on? <laughs> Both of them had shit in them, so it lets you shit in a urinal. One of them was from you. Yeah, I, I was in the first one. <laughs> Yep, that's the one I wanted to take a picture of too. Damn it. I was like, I definitely know this is Jordan. Jordan's fat ass got some, what are those, uh, oh, little man. birthday bites? You want a little birthday bite of my ass or what? They're pretty damn good. Uh, no, I'm on a diet. Then. Seafood diet. I, I see food and I eat it. And actually, I'm, uh... Thoroughly impressed with this e-cig juice. You guys know the last time when I went to New Jersey, I ended up getting some e-cig juice like right by Lance's house. And it was honestly the shittiest e-cig juice I ever had. So I was a little hesitant at getting e-cig juice out here in Wisconsin, just for the simple fact that we're in the middle of fucking nowhere, but it's actually pretty good. Alrighty, so this right here is uh, pretty much gonna be my home for the next week. Just got everything ready for bed, still pretty exhausted. Jet lag is honestly the worst. Jordan. Please just do me a favor. Can you not jerk off like while you're laying on the couch next to me? At least once? No, like I really just don't want to catch you beating off. Oh, right. Like there's so many other things I'd rather see like giraffes having sex or I don't know, goats fucking than you jerking off. Oh, oh shit. It's about to turn into like a porn scene down here. Two giraffes, couple zebras, there's an elephant watching you. I feel like I'm in the fucking jungle right now. I'm in the safari. It's honestly so crazy and like, let me explain jet lag to you guys. You know when I'm in Las Vegas, I'm up to like two or three in the morning every single day. And then I wake up at like 10.30 to 10.45 to start editing my vlog. Right now it is 9.38 p.m. and I am just completely exhausted. For those of you who have flown and like traveled far away and stuff like that, you know what jet lag is. It's only a two hour time difference, but the fact that I took Advil p.m. last night right before I got on the plane and then maybe it wasn't even a good sleep for an hour while I was on the plane. It was like in and out for an hour and then I slept for an hour on the airport ground like come on that's ridiculous and then I took a three hour nap at Jordan's grandma's house so my body is just like wanting to shut down right now tonight I'm gonna get a full night's sleep I'm gonna wake up early in the morning tomorrow probably have a really really good breakfast and then do some stuff during the day for you guys it's just today was hectic you know with Jordan's grandma's birthday and then obviously I needed some sleep but tomorrow should definitely be an interesting day Day. Honestly, I probably think one of the shittiest things about Wisconsin is seeing that I have absolutely no service. So tomorrow I think Jordan and I are probably going to go have to hit the Verizon store and maybe get like a SIM card. Jordan actually has an old iPhone 6 that he can let me use. So that way I can actually get some service because as a lot of you guys know, a lot of my work is always on my phone and I can't do shit without any cell phone service. Like right now I have Wi-Fi, but when we're driving around and stuff like that, I really don't have any good service. If you guys don't follow me on Twitter, you're missing out. I tweeted Jordan and said I'm kind of horny and he responds to me with this. He says, I got something for you. Got me in the background cheesing because he's taking a picture of some Vaseline. And then I tweeted him back and I said, are you sure I can borrow this? Like Jordan and I are always just tweeting some funny ass shit on Twitter. Twitter, so you guys should follow me. 
I'm honestly just like so excited that I could just like roll over at any moment in time and be able to look at Jordan's beautiful face. Oh, um, you're so cute, Dad. Same. Yo, close your laptop real quick. I want to see how dark it is down here. <clears throat> Yo, I'm literally going to wake up and not have any single idea what time it is. I bet you if I end up falling asleep like right now, I'll probably end up waking up at like 3 or 4 in the morning and I won't know what fucking time it is and I'll walk upstairs and it'll still be dark outside. Are you going to say anything or what? Are you talking to me or the vlog? I, both. Oh. I mean, People keep roasting you because you don't ever fucking talk in the vlog. I'm awkward. You're just always like fucking watching your porn videos on your phone and talking to your clients about your male prostitution and shit like that. Like, just pay attention to the vlog once in a while. Alright, tomorrow I'll be passionate, guys. Will you? You yeah. promise? I promise. Pinky promise? I'll see a new Jordan. Yo, should we do the pumpkin spice Twinkie eating challenge tomorrow? Who can eat a whole box of pumpkin spice Twinkies? The fastest? Good. Yeah. Sounds like a good idea. Well, let's just get like five boxes and not go to eat at the fastest. Who pukes first? So all of a sudden I feel something crawling on my fucking arm and there's a fucking spider in this bed, Jordan. You got me fucked up. Believe it or not, it is currently the next day. Jordan has already been up since 8 o'clock this morning. He went for a run and I'm just waking up. I slept a full 12 hours. Jordan, you said you were going to be more passionate in today's vlog. What the fuck? Hey blog, welcome back. It's not a blog, it's a vlog, vlog with a V. Say it again. Welcome back, vlog. Yeah. We're gonna have a good day. You gotta be more passionate. Like, people people don't watch my vlogs anymore because you're so fucking boring. That's true. I'm just kidding. <laughs> but today we're gonna be doing a lot of shit. I need to go to Verizon and get a SIM card for a new phone. As I've said in this vlog a million and one fucking times already, I was just editing it and I realized that I kind of repeated myself a lot, but I was trying to get some vlog footage, you know what I'm saying? Um... What else do we need to do today? Oh, possibly the pumpkin spice Twinkie eating challenge. I don't even think that's a fucking challenge, but I'm going to make it a challenge today. Who can eat a whole box of pumpkin spice Twinkies the fastest? I definitely think I'm going to win. And then, not too sure what else we have planned. We might do bumper cars and shit. I need to get up and shower and get ready for the day. I also need to grab some breakfast. I'm pretty hungry. <laughs> Go figure, right? My fat ass is hungry. Oh shit, had a little nip slip. Shout out of the day goes out to Alex Tiak on Snapchat. If you guys would like to be shout out of the day, make sure to follow me on all my social media accounts. The links are always in the description below. And be active. Like my tweets, retweet my tweets, like my Instagram pictures, screenshot my Snapchat, so on and so forth. And that can help better your chances at being shout out of the day. Once again, I apologize for the short ass vlog yesterday. I know a lot of you guys are like a day and a half of traveling, six minute vlog. Yeah, I mean like normally I try not vlogging the really boring boring shit like me running around and fucking like doing my laundry and packing my clothes because I don't think you guys will find that interesting but if you guys want long vlogs I'm about to just start fucking recording everything and then I guess we'll just see how long of a vlog I can actually have if I just record every single little thing that I do throughout the day maybe not every little thing but almost everything but that pretty much wraps it up for today's vlog I hope you guys enjoyed once again if you did give this video a thumbs up and I will see you guys tomorrow well guys Camera's foggy, but Jordan's getting naked. We're in the locker room right now, about to go in the sauna.